Maybe we should say goodbye to this grocery store. Make sure everybody's uh, enjoying their position today at 1123 Natural Grocers. <clears throat> Be right back. Just gonna say goodbye. I'll be, uh, I'll be really quick. Just gonna say goodbye. All right. <clears throat> Hello. <clears throat> well, amazing collection of things. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hello. Goodbye. Thank you for your service. You're doing a really excellent job. Uh, goodbye. Excuse me. Would you like some help packing your car? No, go away. Okay. Happy we found her stuff. Oh, good. What are you doing? Hello. Nothing. Be right back. Just need to grab okay, some forks from go. inside the market. Everything's okay. Do you have any spare forks for us? We're very hungry. Going to grab some forks from inside. Maybe. Okay, okay. Excuse me. You have to drive three hours. Here we go. Just going to cheers everybody right now. Would you like a piece of cheese, Reese? Um, no, it gets me gassy. Very interesting how you say this. We have much success here. So, look. Thankfully, we were able to help all the homies in the parking lot. Cheers. Cheers. We're going to hit the road right now. Probably catch some scenery or, you know, just like see some really breathtaking things. Just like really seeing nature in all its glory. You know, in all of its awesome glory. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. All right, <laughs> let's go get that freaking fork. I don't know. Well, okay, I don't know if they have forks. We'll see. We'll see. They, they must. They must have some. Mm, that jar is full of bone marrow. We extracted some bone marrow this morning, put it into the jar, hit the road. So maybe we'll scarf it down in a moment. Like maybe we'll just freaking scarf it down right now. I don't know. Excuse me, do you have any forks? Do you have any plastic forks? Please excuse me, I'm not here to disturb you. Everybody seems preoccupied. Hi, do you have plastic forks? Will you please leave the store? Yes, I will, I will gladly leave the store. Just looking here, for, just looking around for some plastic forks, please excuse me. Nope, if you want to take your camera outside and then come back in and ask for forks, that's fine. But it's if you don't about to take your camera right outside, now. I will call the police. We have a policy not to have cameras in the store. Good. So please take it outside and stop filming Perfect, me. Dude. All right, all right. Please excuse me. Excuse me, do you have any plastic forks? Please go outside and if you take, your, take that outside okay. and come back in without it. Frank. Dispatch. No, we just need a plastic fork. 
please excuse me. The frick. All right. <laughs> Hello. Looking great, everybody. You look so good. Uh. Oh. Hello, are these your dogs? Oh. It's okay. Farewell. Oh. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Well. Do you have any plastic forks? Do I want to be wet? Do you have any utensils, like plastic utensils or something? <clears throat> Just looking for some utensils. You need plastic utensils? Why yes. are you filming me? Oh, for no reason. I mean, well, well, I guess if there were a reason, if I could put a reason to this, I'd, I'd want it to be the highest reason. And so, I guess I don't really know. Well, you look like you're exercising really well today. Yes, I am. You're like really radiating throughout the parking lot. And, you know, like we're just bathed in your shadows, the shadows of your glorious light. Thank you. God bless you. And I love your pen. Oh, well, thank you. Our lady. <clears throat> you don't have one. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you so much. Yes. You're welcome. Yo. Didn't have any plastic forks. <clears throat> well, maybe they do actually. Can you please? Uh, can you just please film out of the outside of the window? Or you, you can feel free to speak with the chat users if you like. Feel free to do whatever around me. Gosh, what's he gonna do? <laughs> These poor ladies, I just, oh my gosh. Should I zoom, should I zoom in? Hi everybody. It's freaking snowing guys. I wonder what he's saying. Oh gosh. Guys. I'm sorry, but my seatbelt's buckled in and I'm not following him. Yeah, no, this freaking cheese gets me like, I mean, it's good, but I'd be bloated after eating that. Okay, sorry, sorry. This is Darwin. Whoa, sorry, that was really up close. <laughs> um, so, yeah, guys, this road trip has been going so good. Hey, Josh. You should get out of here. You got a spoon? Yes. It's so beautiful. Well, we're on a three hour drive, so uh, buckle up your seatbelt, everybody. Captain yes. Reese is uh, in charge. <laughs> no. Give them an up close view of what you have in the jar. Bone marrow. <clears throat> we should really get out of here. What did you do? Nothing. She said I was 5'6. What is that? She was like, describe me to the cops. She said I was 5'6 or something. Now they're gonna say they're in a blue Subaru. No, it's okay. Everything's okay. Whatever. It's a freaking spoon. Freaking spoon right here. Yeah. The gas station. And then left while it was overflowing. And... Didn't help, please. <laughs> 
Well, it's just that, yeah, well, yeah like whatever, I don't know. Freaking weird mechanism and crap, but thankfully we're here to enjoy this meal. Okay, guys, please don't press me. We embellish the freaking place. But, like, I, I, my co pilot's a little busy, so. Here, here, let me do this for you.